So it's early in the morning. I'm getting ready. The trailer's all prepped and ready to rock. All I gotta do is uh, wipe it down, mix the paint, and start spraying. Well, that's done. <clears throat> it didn't go on as well as I would have liked it to. Um, that's a primer paint combination, kind of an industrial paint, and it didn't go on that great, but it's a trailer, so I'm not sweating it too much. There she is, painted, and we have the wheels back on. We're gonna go ahead and paint those rims, repaint those rims after uh, we get some other stuff done. Getting the trailer wiring on now. Got the lights on getting them wired um, I've got the plywood for the deck so that's gonna go together next all right we are getting making some progress on this trailer I just wanted to show you real quick what we got going on here so we got this uh, started painting the deck with some deck paint got some bare uh, deck over uh, extra textured paint so we're painting that wiring harness is all hooked up got all the trailer lights hooked up yeah, got that all hooked up, got the uh, brake lines all hooked up, and I'm just working on getting the, the deck down, and then we'll start on the gate. That's all for now. Hopefully this thing comes out good. I'm looking forward to using it for my scoots. All right, well, we got the deck on this trailer now, and as you can see, Mr. Fancy Pants here is uh, making use of the deck. We, uh, I got it all done, it's bolted down now. Wesley helped me bolt it down. He just got back from his little family trip. You want to get off the damn phone, Wes? Huh? Oh, no, I'm like a chick. I got to be on the phone. Yeah, that sounds about right. Uh, oh, Anyhow, sorry. this is the semi-finished product of the trailer. Um, like I said, I used that deck paint on it, and we got that taken care of. It's pretty sturdy. Um, now I just got to finish doing the brakes, get those all hooked up. And then we'll have a scooter trailer ready for scooting all over the place. All right, well, we're starting on the last part of the project. Actually, we're all close to the last part of the project. I'm getting the gate built. Um, unfortunately, my pro welder's not here, so I'm gonna have to use my little wire feed welder that I got here. But I got all the steel cut. The steel is cut, and I got the four pieces I'm gonna use for the frame of the gate. Um, I figured that I needed to make it 68 inches long so I'd have a long enough ramp to drive the scooters up onto the trailer. So that's what I'm doing now. We're going to get going on that and I'll show you how that's working and we'll go from there. That's all. I'm uh, getting the frame welded up now. This is kind of what we got here. So got the frame started. I got it tacked together. Uh, the welds are coming out okay. so. Uh, I think I'm going to stick with it and just keep going. Um, once I get that frame welded up, then I'm going to get some expanded steel and lay it out and put it inside that, and then I'll, I'll go from there. But uh, right now I'm just getting the frame all welded up. Probably not work on the rest of it until I get the expanded steel because i got to lay the steel, the cross pieces in after I get the expanded steel in just to kind of give it some more support. That's all for now. Well, here I am. I got the frame welded up. Now I've got the expanded metal. I got to cut the metal. I'm going to lay the metal in there and then put the back bracing on it. So we're making progress. I'll keep you posted as to how it goes, but we're going to have a scooter trader real soon. All right, so I got one sheet cut and fitted. Um, so that's laid in there. And I'm going to do another sheet in there. And then I'll put the cross braces and start welding that in. And then I'll have the basic uh, trailer gate. So I got I got the mesh all cut and it's fitted now. I got the cross piece in. I haven't welded anything in yet, but that's going to be welded in. Uh, we're making progress on the gate now, so I'm going to weld. I'm going to go ahead and tack in all the uh, mesh, and then start laying in the cross pieces, and then we'll go from there. But uh, 
it's coming along good. I think it's going to work out good. It should be strong enough to hold those scooters. That's all right. Well, I've got the the uh, gate all welded. I just need to finish it. I flipped it over. This is what it looks like. It's actually looking pretty good, and uh, we're getting it done. So that's all that matters. I just need to have a solid deck that I can drive my scooters up on. So I think we've got that. We've accomplished that task. That's all. All right, I'm going to call this thing officially done. <clears throat> I got all the welds done on it. I got the corners cleaned up. And it's real sturdy. It looks like it's going to work good for the gate. And uh, now I just got to um, sand it, paint it, and get the hinges on it. We'll probably weld the hinges to the, the gate and then bolt them to the trailer. So I'll run some bolts to the one end so I can take the gate off if I ever need to. Uh, but that's it. That's it for the gate. I'll keep you posted on the rest of the stuff. We're getting close to the end of this project, which is a good thing. Started getting the hinges welded on here. So I got some barrel hinges that I've welded. They're not pretty, but they're getting done. So I've been welding four barrel hinges on this thing. We'll see how it works out. Uh, then I'm going to mount the gate to the trailer. So that's the next process. We'll go from there. All right. Well, we're just doing the first tests here. And it looks like it's going to hold the scooters no problem. I just got them sitting up here. I don't have them tied down or anything now. But you can see both these big dogs are on this trailer. And uh, now I got to just set up the tie down brackets. I'll show you what I did to the gate. I got the gate on. I haven't quite got it secured. Welded these tabs on the ends. I got all the hinges on. Of course, the gate needs to be painted still. But so far, it looks like the trailer's going to work out good for these two scooters. So we got a utility slash scooter trailer, and it's going to be rocking and rolling, right, Andrew? Sir. Think of that trailer. It's bitching. Do you like it, Andrew? Like Say it. hello. Say hello. hello. Say I like the trailer. I like the trailer. All right. All right. So uh, here's the finished product on the gate. I I made the latches. I put these uh, pin type latches on the gate. So it just pull out, and that releases the gate right there. That seems to work pretty good to hold the gate up in the upright position. And I'll show you how the hinges came out. Here's the hinges. Barrel type hinges, like I said before. I put four of them on, which is probably overkill. I just welded those to steel plates and bolted it on. I ran these pins in one direction, three of them. Then this last pin I ran in an opposite direction. That way, if I want to take the gate off, I just pull these four or three bolts off, and then I can slide the gate off if I want to take it off. But the gate's all painted now. I painted it gray. And uh, that's basically it for the trailer. I'm not going to go through everything else. Tie downs you could work out and use however you wanted. Uh, I'll probably put some on the side here so I can lash down the scooters. I'm also going to run a bar or something across here that the tires can butt up against and also something of the tires to sit down in as far as a channel for them to uh, kind of rest up against and set in. But other than that, this project is done. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe, and just remember, I'm just a man in a cave causing mayhem. Thanks.